Okay, here's something interesting or creepy, depending how you see it. Belgium media artist and privacy advocate Dries de Porter had developed and showcased their latest project they call The Follower. Okay, so how it works is using artificial intelligence and public accessible CCTV cameras, what they did was they took a picture on Instagram and setting an AI to monitor public webcam feeds for a set period of time when they took that picture, the artificial intelligence was able to locate the time and place and find on the CCTV camera in the recording of when the Instagram photo was taken, all using artificial intelligence. Oh, this is interesting or creepy, depending how you see it. So this really goes to show the power of public information. Again, these were public CCTV cameras. So anyone could see them, watch them, or record from them. And that's exactly what they did. To be fair, it's not like they had access to all the CCTV cameras available by the government. No, uh, what happened was uh, they selected a few cameras for the test project and they focused the AI on those cameras. And then what they did is they went in public, they took an Instagram picture, posted it, and the AI found the exact place and time and found in the recording of the CCTV of where the photo was taken. Now, this is the time we put on our tinfoil hat and we think to ourselves, okay, if this can happen from a simple public camera made by a private security privacy advocate, you can probably imagine what kind of technology is being used by, say, government agencies that have access to all the cameras and big massive supercomputers to conduct the processing and data crunching needed to do this on a nationwide scale. But this is nothing new. Uh, human intelligence, human investigators have been using still photos found on social media to find where they were taken at a given time or place. But this really amps up the whole AI artificial monitoring and spying. If you wanna follow the project or see how it works yourself, I'll put a link down below in the description to the project website uh, and uh, give them a follow and like on social media because uh, it's really cool to see what people are able to accomplish using public data and artificial intelligence. Cool or creepy? <laughs> Let us know down below.